MyWoFi is the free browser-based platform that supercharges your WoFi experience and connects your sampler to the world. Effortlessly import and edit samples, manage sounds, explore patches from other users, and connect with the growing community of WoFi users from around the globe. In this video, I will explain everything you need to know about MyWoFi and show you how to use it. To use MyWoFi, create a free account. Access is currently limited to owners of a WoFi sampler. Open mywo.fi in your browser, click on register and enter your data. Once you've registered your account and logged in for the first time, MyWoFi will ask you to activate your WoFi sampler. Press the menu button twice and go to settings, select network, enable Wi-Fi, set up a network, and connect Wi-Fi to your Wi-Fi. Enter your password and select Pair with My Wi-Fi account. Open the QR link with your mobile phone or tablet, choose a name for your device, and voila, your Wi-Fi is now registered and paired and shows up in My Wi-Fi. Let's start our journey by checking out some of the samples, patches and sound banks other users have already shared with the community. Click on the Explorer icon and select Explorer. Browse and preview the best rated samples and patches. And add them to your library with one click. Transfer them to Wi-Fi with another click and play along. Click on the preset icon of a patch to see a visual representation of all the settings as well as a list of the samples it contains. This is a great way to learn more about how sound design with Wofi works and gather ideas for your own creations. You can also use the search bar to find samples, patches and sound banks and sort them. Use the tags to search for specific categories or properties. In the library, you'll find all the samples, patches and sound banks that you've uploaded to MyWoFi or added from other users in the community, as well as the content of your connected WoFi sampler. You can sort the content, use the search tool or sort by tags. Store custom search presets using the view tool. As your library grows over time, use tags to quickly find your samples and group your patches into sound banks to keep things organized. Select the latest tab to quickly find the content you recently uploaded or added. Just like in the Explorer, you can search, sort and listen to content. To transfer a sample or patch to a paired and connected Wofi, simply click on Send to Wofi. Once the transfer is finished, you'll find your content in Wofi's browser. Drag and drop a file or select it with the file browser and press upload. You can also import up to 10 samples at a time. Quickly adjust the batch settings below and you're ready to go. Trim removes silent parts from the beginning and end of samples. Resampling automatically converts your sample to 48 kHz if necessary, which is the sample rate Wofi uses. Since Wofi does not output stereo, you can choose how it should handle stereo files when importing them. Channel 0 creates a mono sample from the left channel of the imported file. Channel 1 does the same from the right channel. And mix sums both the left and the right channel of the original file to a new mono sample. Fade in out applies a volume fade in and fade out for the selected duration. 
This can help avoid clicks at the beginning and end of samples. After uploading, you'll find your samples in the library. Tags are automatically suggested for the uploaded samples. Click the pencil to rename your sample and select tags. Your files will be automatically converted to a compatible format during upload in case they don't meet WAFI's requirements, so you don't need to worry about any tech specs. You can edit your samples directly in your browser with MyWAFI's sample editor. Click on the editor icon, select the start and end point, zoom into the waveform, listen to your sample with the transport controls, and normalize. time stretch and compress your sample to taste in the effects section. Select an area or loop with the selection tool and play it back or click select or deselect all. You can fade in, fade out, crop, trim or remove the selection. Activate zero cross to avoid clicking at the start and end of the sample. After editing, click the save icon to save your sample. To transfer samples and patches from the MyWAFI library to WAFI, simply click on send to WAFI. Once the transfer is complete, you'll find your sample on Wolfi. On the device page, you can view the remaining storage of your Wolfi, rename your device, and perform firmware updates. View the samples and patches on your WAFI sampler in the library with the corresponding filters. Click Retrieve to upload samples or patches from your WAFI sampler to MyWAFI. To speed up file transfers, group several samples or patches using multi-selection. This works in both directions. You can delete content stored on your WAFI sampler directly from the MyWAFI library. If a sample or patch is stored both in your library and on your sampler, you can choose whether to delete it only from your device or from the library as well. Soundbanks are sets of patches that you can curate, send to friends or share with the community. You can create and manage your sound banks in the Sound Banks tab of the library. Click Create a Sound Bank, enter a name and a description. Click Create. To add patches to your sound bank, click Add Patches and select the patches from your library you would like to include. Now click Validate and your new sound bank is created. My Wi-Fi automatically generates a header image. Add and remove patches or change the order by selecting Edit Sound Bank. You can also add patches from the library's Patches Browser tab to one or more sound banks by clicking on Add to Sound Banks. Note that you can only add your own patches or patches by other users that have not been locked. In the top right of the header, you can set the sound bank to public to share it with the community, edit the title and description, share it with friends and groups, or delete it. All your content is private by default. Only you can see and access it. However, if you want to share a sample patch or even a sound pack with the community yourself, you can do so by clicking on the globe icon in the library. 
Note that you cannot undo this step. Once you make something public and share it with the community, it remains available to all users. If you like the sounds of another user, you can follow them. All of their content will be displayed in the Feeds tab of your Explorer. You can also send a friend request to another user on their profile. In the Community tab, you can see your friends, search for new ones, or create groups with multiple friends. In the library, you can then share samples, patches, and sound banks directly with your friends or groups. The sounds you share are not publicly visible to the entire community, but remain private and can only be accessed by you and the friends or groups with whom you share them. This concludes our My WoFi tutorial. We hope it helps you get started and create amazing music with your WoFi sampler. For more tutorials and updates on WoFi, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and see you soon.